Hey guys, so today we're trying apple cider vinegar. And I'm terrified. Apparently, it's used uh, before meals and it has benefits. I hate vinegar. Hate it. Yeah. Any type of vinegar. As soon as anything's fermented, I'm, I'm out. Yeah. Bye. Chuck up the deuces. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I would online apple cider vinegar has like a cult-like following of people that just like swear by it for like everything. They call it ACV. ACV, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like you go to like Whole Foods and like in my vinegar <laughs> aisle, you're like, what's up ACV crew? <laughs> ACV. <laughs> it claims to have all of these health benefits, but at the end of every single article, there is a little sub-blurb that says, <laughs> So at the end of every article, there's subtext that says nothing in this article is founded on scientific research. We'll tell you what people think it does. It, some people say it's really good at killing bacteria, so... And therefore, if you have uh, some kind of stomach condition or pain in your stomach, which is caused by bacteria a lot of times, it can help that. Yeah, but another article we read said if you take it on an empty stomach, you will feel nauseous yeah, and, and it vomit. Yeah, causes stomach pain. That doesn't sound very calming on my tummy. Uh, no, it does not. It says it can <laughs> treat skin imperfections like warts or moles, but at the same time, there's been side effects of people just burning, burning their skin. Their skin. It supposedly lowers blood sugar. It supposedly can shrink tumors and help to cure cancer. <laughs> Why are people getting cancer still? <laughs> that just got dark. They say actually they can be used on your dogs to treat <laughs> fleas. If you put it in a spray bottle um, it, and spray it in your dog's fur, uh, it will kill the, It'll Does that kill sound bugs. like something you want to drink? Could you imagine if your whole dog smelled like that? No. Can't like, imagine if part of my dog smelled like that. Well, I just want to curl up and play and you're like, <laughs> you stink! So the only thing that is scientifically proven... Besides it being gross. <laughs> besides it being gross, is that it can help you absorb more nutrients from your food. So if you have some vinegar in your salad, aka balsamic vinaigrette, you'll be getting more nutrients. But I salad. heard the same was proven about lemon juice in your salad. That lemon juice actually helps you absorb nutrients. And lemon juice, I will tell you, tastes a lot better than this. <laughs> That's true, but you could do both and get all the newts. <laughs> the newts! <laughs> <laughs> that reaction was awful. I've never heard them called newts! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Feel free to use it. I will! Is that how like, guys talk at the gym? Like, y'all, have you tried that protein shake? <laughs> <laughs> that protein shake? <laughs> I forget my hours when I'm pumping. Uh, apparently, it's good to drink one tablespoon with eight ounces of water, and if you drink it just straight up, you can actually burn your esophagus. <laughs> So you have to be careful about how much apple cider vinegar you consume in a day. Um, it's recommended maximum two tablespoons because more than right. that will uh, erode your insides. So let's try this. <laughs> you sprayed me. Sorry, I had to get it out of my mouth. Burn my skin. <laughs> I don't know how people drink that in the morning. I, I mean, they say it gives them energy, but uh, have you heard of coffee? I could not drink coffee. I mean, I could, I, I just, I would never want to. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to prove? We're gonna take a sip of it straight uh, because people do drink it straight. <laughs> oh, that was so gross. <laughs> How do people do that? I have no idea. That's torturous. That's torture. The military should look into this. <laughs> It's a combination of burning and disgust. disgust. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think it'd be that bad. That was really bad. I have friends that drink this every morning. You couldn't pay me to drink that in the morning. Couldn't I? <laughs> Personally, after reading everything and researching a lot about this, um, I kind of deem it a myth in my mind. I don't. I I think it's a trend, and I don't really think there's any I scientific evidence. Definitely it. think it's a myth, especially because literally every article has at the bottom none of this is backed by research or science. So. So why is everybody doing this? Because this is gross. So thanks for joining us and watching us burn our esophagi. Yeah. If you have tried this, you believe in it, you don't believe in it, leave a comment and let us know. Yeah. I don't know what you're going to do with the rest of that bottle. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck with that one. I don't know either. That's going to sit on the shelf a while. <laughs>